Some breaking news! India is officially on the moon. They are now the fourth nation to have landed on the moon and the first nation to have ever landed on the South Pole of the moon. So this is super exciting um, for India. This is exciting for the ISRO, Indian Space Research Organization. Um, that is their space agency that made this possible, that made this mission even happen. And congrats to the whole team working on the Chandrayaan missions. Uh, this specifically is Chandrayaan 3. There were two prior missions before this, Chandrayaan 1, which consisted of a space probe um, that orbited the moon, and Chandrayaan 2, uh, that actually ended up having a failed mission when it came to landing the um, actual lander on the moon. But this one, Chandrayaan 3, was a successful landing on the moon. It soft landed on the moon, and uh, this was their Vikram uh, lander. So this is going to consist of not only the Vikram lander, but also of their rover, which is named uh, Pragyam. I believe I'll double check that. This is the first time uh, there's ever been any sort of mission exploring the south side of the moon. Um, completely on the surface. Uh, there was a lunar space probe before, a uh, NASA lunar space probe that was analyzing the south side of the moon. This is when, uh, in 1998, there was the first evidence that showed that there is water ice in the, the south region craters of the moon. And so a big part of this mission is to analyze that area, where exactly it's located, how much there is, is it um, in a form where it can be converted into drinking water? Is it in a form where it can be used for rocket fuel? Um, these are some of the biggest questions that are going to be explored, I think, during this mission. These are the biggest questions I personally have about the south side of the moon. Um, so I'm very excited. Also just watched a great interview with astronaut Mike Massimino and he brought up a really wonderful point, which is the orbital mechanics that goes into landing on this part of the moon, which is why it has never been done before. Um, it's not super easy versus landing kind of right in that middle part of the moon um, when it comes to launching a mission from Earth. Um, it's just a lot more of a direct path. But the south side of the moon is not as direct. It's a little bit more challenging to, to land there, actually a lot more challenging. And so one thing he mentioned was uh, kind of the hopes that Israel will actually share this information with other space agencies around the world so that other people can also land on this area of the moon. And, and I, I imagine that that's going to be the case. I think that it's, uh, we have a different, very different approach today than we did uh, years ago when it came to first arriving to the moon, where now it's so much more of a collaborative effort of different nations around the world versus sort of this space race competition. Uh, having, having some competition, I think, is really wonderful and, and good. Um, but at the same time, this is something where I think that nations are working so much more together uh, when it comes to space exploration. So I'm just going to sign off there. Um, I would love to encourage you all to check out ISRO, to follow along with this mission, to follow their social media, to follow their news stations, to just find out what information is going to be coming from these missions, uh, to follow along with all the different data that's going to be coming back from this mission, from their lander and their rover, um, and to just yeah, learn, learn some more, uh, see what it's like exploring the south side of the moon. And um, I just personally cannot wait to see what else comes out from this mission. Um, so as always, thank you all so much for tuning in. Uh, my name's Athena. This is the Astro Athens channel. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. I'm going to be launching videos every single week. So um, just make sure you turn on that alert button also. All right, everybody. I'll see you next time. Bye.